In today's video, we're taking a look at how to make bleach disinfectant wipes easy and simple. This is so easy, anyone could do it. Everything that we use on the video, we're gonna leave a link on the description. Even related videos like how to make DIY sanitizer, a bleach based disinfectant spray, and these are the things that you're gonna need. You're gonna need bleach, water, measuring cups, measuring spoons, a can of coffee, or you can even use your empty protein bottles. All that investment is finally gonna pay off in this video. That's why here in the Stata Box team, we have your back. You might have not gained any muscle, but at least we're showing you what to do with those empty protein canisters you had to show off when people come over. But if you don't have a coffee can or protein canister, you can also use Ziploc bags. And optional are a Ziploc bag, if you're not using a coffee can, is add water to the two cup mark. And according to the CDC, for every quart of water, which equals 32 ounces or four cups, we add four teaspoons of bleach. In this case, we're only using two cups, which is equivalent to 16 ounces. So that means we're only gonna use two teaspoons of bleach. And according to the CDC, this is potent enough to clean and disinfect. We're gonna add two teaspoons of bleach. Now that we have our cleaning solution, we can go ahead and mix. And we recommend that you do this in small batches because as time goes, bleach does not stay effective for long. Now we get to the part of the video where you can let your frustration go. And we're gonna do that by murdering this paper towel by cutting it to the height of your coffee can or Ziploc bag. And don't worry, it's gonna be hard to cut it straight. But remember, if it doesn't look perfect, that means it's homemade. But if you have great knife skills and you can make a clean cut, we salute you. Now, let's take a few seconds for the paper towel. Let's get back to business now. Let's take your coffee can and we're gonna make a slit on the top. And this is gonna make it easier to remove each wipe every time. And also a key component of the disinfecting power of this solution is keeping your wipes wet. So you don't wanna make a big hole. Or if using a Ziploc bag, you always wanna keep it airtight. And remember, as best as you can, we encourage mistakes. We're ready to place the paper towel on the coffee can or Ziploc bag. Let's go ahead and take this paper towel to the jacuzzi. We're gonna pour the liquid all around the paper towel slowly. And this is gonna make sure that every inch is gonna get saturated with the liquid. And we're not leaving any liquid behind on our watch. We wait a few seconds so the paper towel can fully absorb the liquid and this is gonna make it easier to remove the roll from the center of the paper towel. Once you do that, you can go ahead and take a piece of the corner and pull it up. Let's go ahead and place the lid back and pull the paper through the lid. Another option that you have, if not making the slit on the lid, you can just open the can and close the can and take the wipe that you need. If you do have a coffee can, you can use the Ziploc to save the other paper for the next batch that you make. Or you can have two of them going at the same time, one on the coffee can and one on the Ziploc bag. And you know guys, girls, both or none, that here at the Stata Box team, we love you. So we want you to take care of yourself, be safe, flex those muscles, and keep showing off those protein containers. Don't forget, if you like the video, please give us a thumbs up. That really helps. If you have any questions, place them in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe, follow us on social media. Thank you for watching. And here's a link to our latest video.